<laughs> hey there, whoa. Let's try that one more time. Hey there, YouTube. Today we'll be taking a look at Windows 1.01 1 .01 for 286 based PCs. And here's the one floppy disk. It was actually originally on like five, five and a quarter inch discs, but I was able to fit it on one three and a half inch. And actually, I didn't do the hard work of fitting it on here. Somebody else did it for me, so it's compressed. I don't know how they did it. Whoever did it, thanks. <laughs> so, to use a mouse in Windows One, you have to have a Microsoft. Has to be Microsoft. You have to have a Microsoft 9-pin serial mouse, so here is one. I don't know if you can really see it, but just give me a minute to plug it in to the back of the frag box. I just unplugged something, didn't I? Yeah. Just look like I broke any pins. That's nice to know. Okay. Just get this thing plugged in. Oh well, what I what I accidentally unplugged was the other mouse, the PS2 mouse. So, might be a good idea to do that. <laughs> I have enough slack on the keyboard cord that made it hard to plug it in. Everything else is still plugged in. It looks like it's good. Okay. You may notice that the Windows directory is still here from my previous video. Which makes sense, because I'm using the same installation of DOS for a, for a third time. So, zoom you in a little bit. Oh, you know what, I can't get it to work perfectly, but... Windows 1 does predate VGA, so I'm going to have to select uh, option number 6, which is the highest quality EGA there was. So, Please don't fail on me. Disc. Okay, so we don't have no pointing device because I dug a, a Microsoft serial mouse out of the closet. Two. Six. Yeah, this may take a while, but. I guess we're just going to have to wait. <laughs> As you may have noticed, when it told me, see, when it tells me to switch a disc, I just press C. Because it's all in one three and a half inch disc. Unlike how it would have been on like five, five and a quarter inch discs. See if this old mouse actually still really works. I've been having a few problems with it, but <clears throat> mm. 
Okay, so... Whoa! It's working! The colors appear to be wrong on the boot screen, but who cares? It's working. Whoa! Now it's really got being Mac OS. Look at my TV's ambient light simmer. That's... I mean, sensor. That's bizarre. Watch. Open the file menu. Ding, 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 ding. Um, that's really weird. Um, nothing down there. Calculator. That's one big calculator. Five plus five equals ten. Okay, whatever. All right. Um, You may have noticed this is a really kind of a weird version of Windows. <laughs> um, so even though it's the original, it's still kind of weird. That's one big clock. <laughs> I usually just have to use keyboard commands because I don't have a mouse. But now that I have this mouse that I know works, that's really nice. Um, control by the XE. Whoa. Yeah, that's pretty funny. All right. <clears throat> Let's find a mess paint or paintbrush, whatever. Paint, P brush. I think it's P brush on this one. No, it's paint. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, so let's say this is high again. High. High on the recipe has been saved. Let's go ahead and start Windows right again. Wherever it is. Right there, you can see there it is. Yay! Windows right! Same weird stuff. All right. Well, let's see. Let's end our session here. It's working great. Let's go ahead and reboot. It's like an MS DOS editor. Out of memory. Press any key to continue. Whatever. <clears throat> There's F disk. Unable to load MS DOS shell. No. <laughs> Alright. Um. Alright, really? Yeah, I forgot that Windows 1 was so much harder to use in the file manager respect, so. Right with me, so there's not been invented. 
The Windows key still does nothing. Yeah, this is a really old version of Windows, in case you were wondering, so... Don't blame it for being stupid. <laughs> Couldn't run that. What the... Icon. Zoom. Yeah, let's zoom it back out. Move. That's strange. Yeah, I don't even understand a lot of the navigation controls in Windows 1. They were kind of weird. Anyway, let's open Windows right back up and close it. So yeah, let's go ahead and end our Windows session, shall we? The weirdest version of Windows in the whole wide world. <laughs> um, Alright, as always, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this Windows 1 video. Turn off the computer. Bye.